good morning guys welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video which is going to be kind of another like come shop with me kind of thing but i'm gonna say but opposite because i've got some things to return but i mean who am i kidding when i return stuff i'm obviously gonna be shopping as well so i need to i'm actually in car park right now i need to go to primark i've got a, thing, a few bits from primark to take back i've got um to take some um lydia's shoes uh sandals back to being there which don't fit her but that isn't that's not here i need to drive to like the retail part for that while i'm here i want to go to primark to take them things back i want to uh, bob to wilkinson's um, and get a few sample pots for the new house which is july we are in july so hopefully it will be this month um so let's get a few little sample pots from wilco's and also look around wilco's home stuff because we all know that's why it's popping at wilco's home um and yeah oh, and also on the way home i've got three giant bags so i'm literally decluttering for the new house and i've got three giant bags uh, bin bags of clothes if i've not worn them in like two years then they're going they've been bin bagged up and they're going um i've got like different piles i've got like a depot pile a charity shop pile a friends pile and then stuff that kind of i feel like don't fit in any of them is getting weighed in so i've got three bags of that but you literally get nothing i'll show you how much i've got and see how much i get fit and i know it won't be much at all but every penny helps especially when you're moving house and yeah so there's a sainsbury's here um and i do need to just like bread milk a few bits of stuff like that but if i see out in there i will film it but i'm not sure if i will and that's about it i think um so yeah i'll show you what i'm taking back from primark because you'll have probably watched my primark videos my shop with me and my haul my primark haul you'll have probably watch them by now so i'll show you the things that i'm taking back which isn't much um but i've still got a few bits to take back And then these are what need returning to B&M. Um, they were literally just five pound, but she just, I'm trying to get us new sliders, which you could probably guess, but she's not liking anything at the minute. So we go return this first, it's quite heavy. Um, go to B, go like round here, then go drive to B&M, then drive to this place. Um, and then yeah, done. Let's go. Dress. How cute is this costume as well? I love this. Oh, how that is so cute. Look how good these things on tops are for the kids. One pound thirty as well. So good. These little plants, I think I've got some of them already for the new house. This candle's kind of cute as well. Four pound. So that's Primark done, and I think I'm just going to bobby Marks and Spencer's just to see what's for tea. See if there's anything I can get in here. So I popped in and got a few bits. I'll show you what I've got because I've got some quite good reduced items um but it is bang opposite power land so it'd be very rude to not go in look at all these fabulous scents exciting not seen this one before either fab ventus it's good these are lots of um fun and cool teacher gifts world's best teacher little book or a canvas so your kids can colour it in before you give them that's cool a, te um, a teacher cup a teacher cup <laughs> cup another one world's best teacher little cups they're great for a pound some cool little homeware stuff that candle looks nice got Lydia this llama and this sheep or whatever it is <laughs> Plants. Oh, she'll like that one. I like these as well. 
Nutley's big um, plant pots, they really have it as well. And they are three pound, but I'm not prepared to carry them around town. And they're cute as well, little herb garden box. Oh my God, today's actually turned out red hot. So I've done with the shopping centre. I'm on my way to Wilco's, which is just literally off the road. Um, and then Sainsbury's and that's it for this part of shopping. Also, I got quite a few reduced bits of food again for Pound Shop. I'm like on a reduced food hunt. These uh, copying sugar pots are cute, but also I love these like marble ones. They're seven pound each. I love them ones. Lots of cool for plants here as well. This one reminds me of a snake. <laughs> Do you know, like them snakes that like different colour stripes. This one's quite cool with the black on as well. And that's ten pound. Although this one's quite cute as well. That one's ten pound. Also, if you've been following, you'll know that this vase will look brilliant in my bedroom. That one's eight pound. Do love this one. And then little cute candle holders there. Let's see how much they are. Oh wow, they're only five pound and you get the candle as well. That's actually really good, five, five pound. Oh, that's cute as well. One thing at a time, need to remember that. I love these cushions, like with the pom-poms on. And I think this is the kind of colour we're going for in the bedroom. It's like a stone colour. Um, I do need to go to get some sample pots actually which is the reason why I've come in here so I shouldn't be down here really let's go to the sample pots so these obviously are the tester pots but this is the kind of thing that I'm going for so like coastline biscuit, oatmeal, taupe different kind of taupes warm taupe, gentle oatmeal all this kind of vibe all this cosy grey looks a bit like a stone colour as well Oh, look at these as well, storm cloud. <gasps> Mineral stone. This is what I need a sample pot of. There's some tester pots here. So I hope that they'll have, oh, they've got all sorts of colors. Let's have a look then, what have we got? Mocker, oh, warm well, top there. Gentle top, I'll get a few of these. Oh, that's Wilco's all done now. So now to just go to Sainsbury's, but kind of peckish. Might see if there's a queue at Sainsbury's Cafe. If not, we'll go for some food. I'll show you a few bits I've got as well. I've got two bags. Um, and I managed to, I think I've got eight test pots. No, I didn't. Six, maybe. Maybe six test pots. I can't remember, but I'll show you what colours I got. So I've made it to Sainsbury's Cafe. I've got a tea and I've got a vegetarian breakfast coming. Um, I'll show you what that looks like when it gets here. I've got some shopping like there, but I thought I'll just show you when I get back to the car rather than me taking it all out here. So I'll show you what breakfast looks like. I cannot wait. I've missed saying this breakfast. This is what I call a breakfast. So I'm just in the home and I've got some really cool like little mats. Um, first one's reduced as well and it's like this Dalmatian runner which I thought was super cute and that was 28 reduced to 18 and then there's this one as well like a runner um, which like the geometric pattern which I think is super cool as well that one's 25 home sweet home Ooh, so excited I even just like this little beige one like up with the big wool there Welcome, that's cute. Need to be thinking about a doormat. Mm. I'll look at these baskets as well, these laundry baskets. £40, that is adorable. Oh my god, so is that one. Sainsbury's have some right good um, homeware stuff. Um. Like, look at all this section here. And this um, big plant here, that's £26, which I love. I also love this because that's kind of the colour I'm going for my bathroom, like this dark green colour. So that would be cute for my bathroom, the downstairs toilet. There's just so much cool stuff here at Sainsbury's. 
I'm not sure if I've shown this before, but I love this light like, lantern um, table lamp. I love that. Bed covers. I do need to have um, a good look now because I've took my other one back to Primark. But this is the, that vibe, like the thing I'm going for. Do you know why it's like textured here? Um, although I don't particularly like how that looks, but I want it how it stands up here, but kind of all over. Um, there's loads to choose from. It is white I'm wanting as well, but Lydia might be worth coming here and having a look for her bedroom as well. Right guys, let's drive to the next destination, b and Oh my gosh, it is absolutely boiling. I can't even, I've turned my car off so I can't see what temperature it is, but just know that it is hot temperature. Um, so I've just pulled up at b and well the retail part, but b and was like over there, range is there, home bargains is there, but I'm staying out because we're bobbing into b and to take Lydia's shoes back and maybe just a little cheeky look, but that's it guys, so let's go. Look at all this fabuloso stuff, there's so much. This giant big, oh, Collie Cole. There's this massive fabuloso in opulence. Summer berries, gold torch, orange and apricot. Lemon sherbet, which I'm not actually keen on. I bought washing liquid in that, and it's not my favourite. But look at these twin packs as well. I can't wait to show you what stuff I've bought for my new house. Oh, what's these twin packs as well? Laundry cleansers. Oh my god, I am actually so hot. I need to get changed. Um, okay, B and M is done. I took the shoes back. Ended up spending twenty six pound. Did get Lydia some more um, sliders though in a size 4. The other ones were 1 to 2 and they seemed quite small. Um, she's normally a size 1 to 2 but they did seem um, quite tight. So I got her some different ones in a size 4 so hopefully they'll fit. And I also got lots of, fab well, cleaning products but the majority it was fabulous cleaning products. Now let me tell you. I'm excited to show you these fabulous products, what I've got. I'm going to try and keep like unopened. Um, so then when I move into new house, I've got nice new cleaning products. <laughs> God, I sound sad, do <laughs> um, But I might need it, you know, like to do my own house a deep clean before I hand the keys back over or whatever. But hopefully we'll save them for the new house. We'll pack them like straight up now. And then they're, they're ready. Um, but I can't wait to show you. They've got all sorts of stuff. Um, in fabulous range at the minute, I'm just loving it. Right, guys, let's go and wear them three bags of clothes in and let's have a laugh at how much money I get from it. Right, guys, I am back home as you can see. Um, so I will go through now. Oh, I'll tell you how much I got from the clothes first. So there were like three fully jam packed bin liners worth of clothes. I was expecting around eight pound and I got 10 pound 60, which is not amazing, but hey, it's 10 pound off what I've spent today, right? And some of the clothes as well had to go um, to charity. They couldn't take them. I don't really know what they do. I don't know if they like send them back to Poland or or what, do you know, to like sell in Poland? I don't, I don't know, um, but it's literally 50p a kilo, I think. And I think they have them everywhere. Like I said, I do have bags for charity, bags for weighing in and bags for family and bags for selling. <laughs> so I did um, I did get £10.60, which I was quite pleased with, actually. Also, I did go to B&M, as you know. I am going to show you what I got from B&M in a separate video because, as always, I spent and bought more than what I actually went and intended to do. So if I put it into this one, it would be way too long. So in this haul, it's a little Primark haul, a little Poundland haul and 
um, the paint pots from Wilco's and just a little Marks and Spencer's reduced bag and food haul hun. That's what's happening right now. So I'll just show you the few bits I got from Primark. I was really good and I only got myself one top and it's just this bodysuit. I actually have these bodysuits in, I think in a pink and mauve color and a white and they're really comfy and they're just like fit perfect. So I just thought this is perfect just to tuck into shorts or jeans and things like that. Um, and that was a five pound. It is made using organic corn as well, which I love. But that was five pound. I got Lydia these socks because if you watch my Primark cars, you'll know that these are the only socks Lydia will wear for whatever reason. Um, and all the white ones have seemed to have just disappeared. And obviously she needs white ones for school. So I just topped them up. You get five uh, trainer liners for two pound fifty. Oh, this is made using sustainable cotton as well. So that's good. And the last thing from Primark was this candle from a new house. It's chamomile, which I thought was super cute. And is that kind of like a bathroom scent? Uh, but it comes with this like little, you know, like a glass lid. I don't want to undo it because then it might get bashed up and like the move to the house. But um, it's like a little cake stand thing with a little glass lid that goes on. So I love that. And that was, I think that was four pound. Yep, yeah, that was four pound. That's it for Primark. Oh, Sainsbury's, I'll just quickly show you this. So mainly I got food from Sainsbury's, which I'm not gonna bother showing you, but I will show you these I got. Just some like little sandals, and I love these. These are from me. I did want to get Lydia um, some, and I walked around a few times to see if they had her size, but they didn't, so I just got myself some. Uh, but I did get her some from B&M. So these were six pound six pound for some sliders from Sainsbury's now I don't know if they'll fit me and you're not allowed to try them on in store and um, so you've got like 29 days or whatever to return them so I'll try them on um, and see how they fit but I love them for six pound aren't they cute right we'll show you the paint pots from Wilco's now these are all one pound 25 which I think is brilliant you get a decent amount of paint just to even if you just want it for arts and crafts £1.25, I think the bargains. So I've got this green pot. Now this is called Dark Ivy. This is my idea for the downstairs toilet. I want like dark green, um, gold and black in the downstairs bathroom. So that's why I got that just to try it out. I've got two greys, I think. Um, I don't know, well, probably these two, you grey ones. That's kind of a stony grey as well, and that's like a grey grey. That one's called Storm Cloud, and that one's called Grey Skies, and I love both of them. So, they're so nice. I don't even know how I'm gonna choose one colour to do which room. Um, I just got a white, just because um, I thought a white's good to, you know, because this house is vented, I need to like, do little um, jobs like, you know, if the paint's chipped off a door or a ceiling or I don't know. Do you know what I mean? Just like little odd jobs like that. I literally picked the white up just to do the odd jobs with. Now this is the colour which I think I'm fancying for my bedroom. And this one's called Perfectly Grage. What? Grage? Grage? <laughs> but I am loving this one for my bedroom and I might end up going with this. I'll see what Chris thinks. Not that he's that bothered to be honest, but um, I think it might that might be the winner. And then I do also love this, but this could be the lounge because we've not kind of set on a colour for the lounge yet. So this could always be the lounge colour, if not, but that's another beautiful colour. I've got a feeling Lydia might like that. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six of them for £1.25 each. And then I've got two of these, and I think these were a pound each as well, just little tester brushes. Honestly, guys, if your kids are like bored or whatever, or they've been to arts and crafts, I'd go to Wilco's and just pick up some of these brushes from the tester section. And some little test pots because you can't go wrong. So I'm pleased with them. Um, oh, Primark, Mr. Primark went off. I got these reusable cleansing pads to like taking makeup off with because I am trying to be a bit more eco-friendly. I'm not saying I'm gonna stop buying it. I'm not um, buying brand new clothes. I'm not saying that. I'm just trying to do my bit in being a bit friend uh, friendly, <laughs> in being a bit eco-friendly like all round. So if this can stop me from buying um, makeup remover wipes, then that's 
that's my little bit done oh hi blue um, and then you get 10 of these for two pound and i know the white company um do ones like this as well that there won't be 10 for two pound with the white company either right pound shop um i don't look like i got much from there ah, ah. it's after the pair of breads excuse me thank you so i got this bottle which i'm super pleased with i've been looking for one like this um for a while i guess this is actually for water um to pour a glass of water at the dining room table darling but i've actually bought it to put olive oil in just because i don't know about you guys but when you're like cooking and all that and all your vegetable oil olive oil and all that it goes all over like plastic bottle and then plastic bottle dints in so you're squeezing it it's slimy so I just thought this is going to be easier all around just to keep like topping it up in there so that's why I got that one um I just got these little chocolates because they are amazing Elliot wanted me to pick him up a galaxy ripple so there you are Elliot there's your galaxy ripple now these are two little bargains from pound shop I've got this ham which is 25 pence so I'm going to do crisp for tea tonight a jacket potato with salad and ham look at that I think it's out of date today or tomorrow as well. Today, it goes out of date, so it's absolutely fine to eat now. Um, and then what I don't put on Chris's plate, I will let Blue and the cats have a little treat of it. But also, I've got chicken breast pieces as well for 25 pence, and they also go out of date today. So I might even, like, give Chris a jacket potato with salad with ham and chicken. <laughs> it's a bit too much. Um, but again, what doesn't get eaten, I'll... Um, let the cats and the dog have a little bite of it and have a little treat. So I'm super pleased with that. I'm 25 pence each. Love that. Then, even more bargains in Marks and Spencers. So I picked up these four minute British pickle topped pies. Um, seasoned outdoor bread, British pork and red Leicester cheese in traditional pastry. Pastry? Pastry with plowman style pickle basically the pot pies <laughs> but they've got like um, pickle on top and they were four for one pound 21 and they should have been two pound i just got six white pears because i've just bought uh, me and elliot some hummus and some carrot sticks and cucumber sticks so me and elliot will probably have some pear with hummus um, and salad and they were 50 reduced to 33 pence Lydia's absolute favourite in the world. In fact, I got two of these um, mozzarella sticks coated in a crispy golden crumb. So, oh wow, so these were three pound and they were reduced to 93 pence. Oh, I wish I'd have got more actually, I bet you could freeze them. Anyway, I've got the, uh, two packs of them because I know that she will absolutely love them. She's obsessed with mozzarella sticks. Right, guys, as I say, I'm so glad I'm not filming what I got from B&M as well because this video is probably going to be super long. If you made it to the end, thank you so much. Um, I really appreciate every single one of you. Um, thank you. And if you did like it, please do like and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.